The busy week ahead on the International Space Station. Astronauts are gearing up for another dangerous spacewalk to finish fixing that broken cooling system. But first, they have a serious wardrobe malfunction to take care of. ABC's Mike Betcher explains. In a crippled International Space Station, a successful Christmas Eve spacewalk would be the best gift of all for the six astronauts on board. Station Houston with you. Hope everybody had a good day. A Saturday spacewalk brought them halfway to that goal. American spacewalkers Rick Mastracchio and Mike Hopkins removed a broken 780-pound coolant pump whose failure jeopardized operations aboard the space station. Don't let that go. That's a stocking stuffer. But a malfunction in astronaut Mastracchio's suit My toes are quite cold. forced the postponement of a second spacewalk scheduled to complete the repairs. We want to dry that suit out overnight. For the second spacewalk in a row, water in the spacesuit was an issue. Just to be safe, the astronauts will use a backup suit. It's their life support system. So somebody on the ground, a team on the ground, is making a big plan to put that new suit together. This is the suit they are wearing behind glass in a display at the Johnson Space Center. At 35 years old, it could be a museum piece. But NASA, always facing budget constraints, must make old things work. We've done over 11,700 hours of spacewalking, so I think it was just a, a small blip in the road that just happened to catch us. And so NASA and the astronauts on board the space station have this Christmas hope that those aging spacesuits are gifts that keep on giving. Mike Betcher, ABC News at the Johnson Space Center, Houston.